Hello students, a very good morning to all of you. In previous video, we have seen the little bully from unit 8. Lesson we have already started and in that lesson, we have learned that about one boy, notorious boy and that boy's name is Harry and he loves to pinch other students and one day they just went for a picnic but all other students they were not ready to sit along with him they were not ready to hold his hand so he became angry and sit in a corner and at that time one monster crab came towards him and pinched him up to this we have learned i hope up to this you have understood now take out page number 138 up to this we have completed right you can observe the picture that harry he was taking his breakfast and that monster crab came towards him and just pinching his hand Ah, that uh, page number 137, that one paragraph it is left. So, first we will complete that and then we will move towards the next page. Ah, here is my good cousin, said the crab pleasantly. And to Harry's horror, he saw a large sandy lobster. Here you can see the sea creatures, insect, right? So here crab and here lobster. So he is telling that he is my good cousin. That means similarities are there between two. So he is telling like this. He saw a large sandy lobster crawling heavily out of the pool. Before the little boy could stop him, the lobster took his hand in his great pincer-like claws and pitched it so hard that Harry yelled. Usne bhi jor se pinch kiya, so Harry kya karta hai? Shout karta hai. So here you can see the different creatures, sea creatures. And they were trying to pinch to the hurry as if hurry is always pinching to other students too so this creature they are pinching to him to give him lesson now hurry yelled in pain usko bahut pain ho raha tha so wo shout kar raha tha then he started Sorry, he stared at the pool in surprise. For out came sandy colored shrimps and prawns. More crabs and another large lobster and they pricked Harry till he was soon black and blue with their pinching. All the sea creatures, they were pinching to the Harry till his skin become black and blue. Now he was realizing that how it is painful. When he was pinching to other students, they were, he was not able to feel that it's paining. But now he is able to feel that how painful it is. Don't you like it? Said all the creatures in surprise. All the creatures, they were Asking in a sarcastic way, in a surprising way. Why? We were told you would love to see us because you were a champion pincher and pricker yourself. Come, come, join in the fun. All that creatures, they were asking, you don't like all these things because you love to see us. And 
he was just painting other students so they thought he like all this thing and he is champion pincher and pricker so that creatures are calling him that come and join in the fun hari leapt to his feet crying loudly his lunch rolled into the pool and when the crabs and lobster saw it they ran to it and began to feast eagerly hari saw that they had forgotten him for a time and he turned and ran for his life tears streaming down his cheeks so hari was crying loudly and during that time his lunch just fell down side in the pool and at that time all the creatures like crabs lobster and other creatures they ran towards that lunch and trying to begin the feast they were eating that food and enjoying hari saw that that for a while they forgotten all these things and he just turned back and run for his life to save his life he just run away from the creatures and tears were coming outside from his eyes and rolled on his cheeks they only did to me what i keep doing to the other children he thought but how it hurt and how i hated those crabs and lobsters i suppose the other children hate me too well i jolly well shent pinch or prick any more now he has realized that i don't like all these things if that creatures are pinching me how painful it is so i hate these creatures and he was thinking that when i am doing same thing to other children so they will also hate me right but now i will not do such kind of things i will not pinch other students or prick any more so here that uh, our lesson it is over and i hope that you have understood now let's see the word meanings grace that is injury by blow to body it's one kind of injury horrid that means terrible horse that means rough and deep sounding rough sound pincer gripping tool uh, in gujarati we are speaking sand c right stock main stem and nip that means pinch so i hope that you have understood the lesson and word meanings so word meanings you have to write one time in your english notebook and lesson you have to read one time do reading practice at home every day okay thank you have a nice day